What's up guys, Daryl Production Studios here, and today I'm back with a 2015 set review. Here we have the AAT, set number is 75080, recommended ages are 7 through 12, which nobody cares about, and it has 251 pieces, and it retails for $25, or $24.99. Right off the bat, great price per piece, 250 pieces, $25, great 10 cents per piece. You get three figures and a cool build. This is a controversial set because most people think it looks too small. But I actually think it looks pretty accurate. I do like the blue one from 2009, I believe, better. But this is a great alternative if you didn't get that one like me. So I'll start with figures. Here we have the standard pilot droid. Just some tan printing on the chest. Other than that, nothing new. Should mention he comes with a small pistol with the scope on it. Secondly, we get a standard battle droid. If you haven't seen these guys before, get out of the rock you're living under, please. And third minifigure is Jar Jar Binks. No changes to the actual printing on Jar Jar. This was a great Jar Jar. Great version of him. He has the printing on the back of his fins, I guess. And he comes with a ray shield and the little pole with the energy ball on the top. So now onto the set. The turret on the top rotates 360 degrees. These cannons on the sides don't move at all, sadly. Here on the front we have an opening hatch, you open that up, there's really nothing inside of there, just blank space. What you can do, you can take your pilot droid, fold him down into the storage form, toss him in there, close that up, you're ready to go. Then for the gunner on the top you open that, and you have to take the blaster off of the droid, but you can sit him in this form and leave the hatch open and it looks pretty cool. Or you can, if I can get him out, you can fold his head down like this and put him as far back as you can go. And then you have to work with it just, just to figure out where it'll close. But you just put him back and it'll close like that and it looks pretty cool. On the side here we have these tubes. Looks really awesome. I think Lego did a great job. Just small little details all around the whole thing. Then when we get to the back here, and you see these two little gray knobs, well if you push up on them, they will actually shoot spring-loaded shooters, so I'll shoot them in the box. Uh, I just lost one actually, but they're in this burnt orange color. There's one extra included in this set, in case you do lose one, I'll have to find that one later. But you do get three of them, but only two of them fit in the vehicle itself. Alright guys, so that does it for this video. This is a, a great set, I think. I I think people just aren't giving it a chance. Because, I I don't know, I just think this is a great alternative. For anyone who didn't get the last AAT, or the one before it, this is a decently sized AAT for a good price. All in all, I think this is a great set. Like me on Facebook. Be sure to subscribe to my channel. Give this video a big thumbs up, and I will see you guys in the next review. Until then, guys, this is Daryl Production Studios signing off.